consisting of Lord Pethick Lawrence, Sir Stafford Cripps, and Mr. A. V. Alexander, arrived in India in March 1946 to discuss terms for the transfer of power. The cabinet mission began its work by interviewing leading representatives of the main political parties. And he came to Delhi to meet the British delegation at the request of Lord Pethick Lawrence and lived at the sweeper's slum. Gandhi remained in touch with the mission during the progress of the constitutional negotiations. Simla was fixed as the venue for further talks. Abul Kalam Azad, Jawaharlal Nehru, Khan Abdul Ghaffar Khan and Sardar Vallabhbhai Patel arrived in the first week of May to represent the Congress viewpoint in the conference. Gandhi accepted the delicate role of advisor to the cabinet mission and came to Simla having full faith in the mission's intention. The poor parlors continued at the Viceregal Lodge, but the conference could not achieve an agreement between the Indian National Congress and the Muslim League and broke up on May 12th. After the failure of the Simla conference, the cabinet mission set forth its own plan on May 16th, rejecting the partition of India on defense, economic and administrative grounds. As the crux of the solution, they recommended a united...